As we struggle to open our economy again, the idea of financial planning is more important than ever. So how and where do we start? Joining me right now is certified financial planner, Jan Tinhagen. Thank you for your time. Um, I know that when you talk about financial planning, you're talking about like a six point planning. Uh, t just go through those six <coughs> points real quick. Well, yes, the six points of financial planning are uh, creating an emergency fund, creating an education fund, uh, making sure your insurance needs are covered, uh, start for, with a retirement plan, um, manage your debt or get out of it, and create an estate plan. And it may seem like a silly question, but why do we need a financial plan? I think a lot of us know that why um, now. Well, but. well one, of, one of the reasons is I've been doing this for many, many years, and I get so many times, uh, well, what about uh, your finances? And one spouse or the other will say, oh, uh, my spouse takes care of that, my wife or my husband. And my question to them is, what happens when they pass away or get disabled? Who's going to look out for you then? So I think everyone should have a financial planner, even if one person is the, the provider of that education, but they have somebody to fall back on if and when the, the time comes. And when, you, when you're looking for a financial planner, <coughs> you should be looking for a certified one, not just a financial planner, because anyone can call themselves a financial planner, right? Literally everybody out there says, oh, I'm a financial advisor, and it's, it's a bogus term. If it's a certified financial planner or a CFA, You've got somebody that has a lot of knowledge uh, and experience and can help you, truly help you. Okay, uh, great advice. Uh, thank you so much. Certified financial planner, Jan Tenhagen, thank you again for your time. Thank you. Take care.